this is Eddie Collins and today we're talking about getting the bluesy sound into your bluegrass picking. Normal bluegrass picking uses the major scale. Notes from there, a song like Nine Pound Hammer. secrets to getting your blues sound and swapping out that lick is one of the best ideas to start to get the idea so I could play that lick instead of coming down here on fret 2 I'll come down on fret 3 now I got a blues lick I practiced that in a little loop just doing some alternating rolls secret is there's this pentatonic blues scale. Pentatonic meaning five notes, open third string, third fret, second string, first fret. Avoid the open second string. First string open, third fret, and the fifth string. You can get into any one of these sounds of the open strings by sliding from the previous note or hammer on. Gives you the uh, Ralph Stanley song, Clinch Mountain Backstreet. All out of the blues scale. So here's a little uh, blues tag lick. These licks are ones I presented in the June 2017 issue of Banjo Newsletter. Here's licks three and four. Lick five, the two three hammer on. Lick six is the bluesy potato intro. I'll do it four times and go into Old Joe Clark. Lick seven and eight could be for any progression that ends G, D, G, where it's a half a measure G, half measure D, back to G. That happens in Old Joe Clark. Lick eight. Lick nine is a lick that can be played against a C chord. Lick ten is a lick that can be played against a D or D seven chord. Lick 11 is a fancy lick that could be used to end a fiddle tune. Here it is with the pre-ending. Lastly, here's a bluesier version of Nine Pound Hammer. 